guy here looks like he's seen better days. It's really quite neat when you kill certain things with certain spells. Like that one that was frozen then got blasted by a fireball and exploded. Right then, let's go down to level 2. I assume this is going down. This is uh, catacombs are going to be down here, or it's assuming that the jail levels are the catacombs. Wee, it's a trap. Again. I, need mana. I love the ability to just flip through the hotkeys like this, so if Diablo 3 plays like this, it's going to be quite awesome. But I'm also hoping that you can uh, have some sort of ability to sort of show a cone of fire in front of you. I'm thinking ahead, and it's all in my... It is all in my head. Thinking ahead. And I can't really explain it too well, so I'm not going to try too hard. But I'm sure Chris will do a good job of it. I've seen some videos already, and it is looking rather snippy. I wonder if anyone would actually watch one of my videos, these like Diablo ones, the whole way through. Can't imagine that they would. This is more for nostalgia and uh, something to look back at many years down the line, should it still exist. I can't carry anymore. Oh, I'm actually uh, filling up on space. It hasn't been happening for a while now. That looks like a huge weapon. <laughs> Whilst it be tempted to go back and save and uh, sell some stuff, uh, I reckon I'll just get to the end of this. And then finish this off. Is there anything else that drops? I'm not really going to worry about it too much. It's not like I need the money. Plenty. But I really actually can't pick up anything else now. I'm completely and utterly running out of space. That might help a little bit. These prison cells are actually rather big, aren't they? Spoilt these prisoners. Spoilt rotten.
least we're tempted to start getting lightning actually, a respec to lightning or something. Because at the moment, because if you can respect for free, then you can just respect for whatever the act requires. And so far, I am overburdened. this level, it seems to be loads of tons of AoE that would be required of I me. I am overburdened. Rather than this single damage firebolt that I've been spamming for god knows how long. Oh, try and keep the weapons because I reckon they're going to be most valuable. Ah, uh, not ranged mobs. Be back. I need mana. Guy just sitting there. Just gonna... Yeah, but where's these catacombs I've been hearing about? I just have gone in a complete and utter wrong section. And I've just cleared an entire couple of levels unnecessarily, apart from getting a bit of experience. Not enough mana. I am overburdened. I'm doing alright for health, but I suppose I can get a bit more. Why not? At least I know I can teleport I back to the mind. prison if that's where I need to go. Spiky club. I am overburdened. Certain that we Yeah, yeah. Well, it looks like the only way is back to the rogue encampment by the looks of it. Just 
check one more place. Yep, that's it. Suppose I might as well get the next level. Top area. But why would it just be? Uh, where are these catacombs then? Where are they? No more levels. This looks like something. Yes, it does. Okay, we are getting somewhere. That's what I'm after. Now, I don't know how much further this is going to go on, but I might need to go back and sell some shizzle just to clear up the space for the rest of this. Kick him. <laughs> Look at that kick. Where's my next level? Almost there. Then let's um, go back. Try going back through the rogue encampment portal just to see if that does anything at all. But I don't think it will do anything different other than saving and exiting. I think that would have pretty much the same effect. what I thought it might do. Yep, and you can get back. I suppose that's the benefit of using the town portal. Yeah, I have to consider that because at the moment I've just been using the natural portals and then running up there, but if I use a town portal, it gets me to go back directly. Hello. Let's get some cash.
What you need? That looks ridiculously good. I don't know if any of that 49% enhanced damage means anything towards my actual casting though. That's the only issue I have is I don't know that does anything to casting. And I guess I will never know. some more vitality. Now this is interesting because now I can get fireball. What other stuff can I get? Telekinesis. See, that would be quite interesting, something like Static Field. Try and mix and match a lot of these abilities, but then again, it's just going pure flat out into certain abilities, just better off. I suppose once uh, I need to get Fire Mastery, I might need to just go pure fire, but until then, I don't know. Then I don't know that. Fireball. Not here. Hmm. Surprise, she doesn't sell any better healing potions and such, but there you go. It is what it is. Let's go back to the jails. She looks like she's in some sort of schoolgirl uniform or something. Isn't she? She doesn't look like a proper sorceress. It's very silly. Like some sort of Harry Potter character or something. I can hit you through there. Yes, I can. What are you gonna do? Not much. Oh, time to, for me to test out something new. Hey! Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Just gotta remember all the hotkeys for the abilities. If you've been playing the game for years and you probably get it down quite easy, but if you're just picking it up as you go, then uh, it's going to be a bit more challenging to remember stuff. Mana does regenerate quite quickly. That's pretty good. Yeah. 
let's try and find this anadurial character. Owned. See, that's so good. How can you not get that? Just one point infested into that talent. The ice armor that freezes enemies if they even get one hit on you. And it seems to be like a guaranteed hit. I see where World of Warcraft got so many of its uh, abilities from. To the inner cloister. So hang on a second, this is going back. Is this where I want to be? I don't know. Is this going to lead to the catacombs? This is going on, isn't it? Entering the cathedral. No, do I even want to go in these areas? I'm really just going to run through all of this and try and find specific areas and hopefully I don't get too overwhelmed by certain mobs. Just want to find the catacombs area, basically. So I know that I'm going in the right direction. There's something to the right. So I'm going to have to go around here. And around here. So the catacombs, that's exactly what I was looking for. Finally, so this I went for all these... Me to the bone. Went for all those jails and all of that. And this is only level one of the catacombs. Right then. Well, since I've spent so much time in the dungeons already, and I'm only going to get more rubbishy items, let's just run on through here and hopefully I don't get too overwhelmed by mobs and just try and find where it is this anadarial character might be hiding. Oh, this is a little overwhelmed by mobs. This is what I'm talking about. I've got to be careful here. Ooh, I'm gonna die. Some AOE, that's what I'm talking about.
Is that a boss? That is a little boss, isn't it? Because he ain't dying easy. They run out of potions. There we go, getting somewhere now. Level two. It's locked. Lovely. I was wondering why that one was taking a bit longer to kill. Not enough mana. I am overburdened. Doing a bit better now, getting through it without dying quite so often. Now I'm getting the hang of it all. And I should be able to speed through the next three acts and the expansion actually as well. From what I've learned in this first act, to be honest, it's helped me a lot. Oh, this spider's amazing. Oh wow, they've all come back to life. Marvelous. Better get those damn shamans down there. Make sure every single shaman is dead before even bothering to kill these things. 
And there's nothing left to explore in these rooms anyway, so... I can't get up. Oh, this is tough. Well, that was pretty dang close, to be honest. And it still is, because I've still got bugger all health. Right. I know there's probably more shamans in there, but I can't get inside, can I, very easily? Is that another level down? Yes, it is. Down I go. No point messing around in a... can come level I don't need to be in. Just go straight for it until I find this boss. Take her down. Hey, is that another level down? Did I find it super fast this time? Look at that. Down we go. Right, this is it. She's on this level. It lets you know, basically, because it comes up, the quest pops up and says, Kill and Dariel. So she's here somewhere. Hello, Mr. Gore. Question is, have I got enough health mana to take her on anyway? I might get all this distance and then have to back out and I haven't got a scroll to town port so I can't even get back very super easy unless I can find a scroll to town port hopefully I have to start doing a bit more looting well there's some more potions at least Take a few hits, don't they? I can't carry anymore. Two-handed sword, that looks expensive. Now we do some AOE damage. Chuck some AOE in there. I need mana. Yep, they got a shame in there somewhere. There you are. Any more? Any more for any more? Gotta remember to try and keep that shield on. Hey, hey, hey. Not enough mana. Oh, no.
I need mana. <laughs> Swap some of my spells about. Right. Hello. Oh, wow. Beast. It's Kerrigan. It's freaking Kerrigan. Yeah. Starcraft. That looks like I've been poisoned. That's not good for me. Well, wow. I'm actually gonna die here unless I can get some sort of anti poison thing. She's someone I have to kill quickly, and that's not good. Look, the poison's still going. I think I'm really gonna have to back here, to be honest. Oh my god. Oh, at least I'm not poisoned anymore, so I just gotta try and knock it here. Oh, I think she's going down. Using my expensive fireballs to really do the damage. So I don't have to fight it for too long, and there's another poison, so down you go. You can't mess around with that. Ooh, it's exploding and I'm gonna die. Actually, I have to out heal this poison. Wee! The evil queen has fallen. I'm gonna make sure I get all the uh, stuff that she drops without clicking on that portal that's gonna send me back home. Because that's the sort of thing that'll happen. I don't care too much about you, but why not kill you anyway? Anything else down here apart from lots of gold? And I dinged as well, because I just killed a few extra mobs up here. That's nice. It's nice. Right. Right you are. Back we go. Oh, she's she's gonna get me with her quest. Oh no, okay. he's gonna get me. This is a great victory indeed. But many more battles await. I will accompany you on your journey, lending what assistance I can. Remember, Diablo is still out there, seeking something in the desert. I'm afraid that this nightmare will not end until you find what it is that he seeks. Yeah. I knew there's some sort of desert or sand level on this because I'm sure I've seen my oh, dad play it ages ago. And Dariel's death brings about renewed life for us all. We mourn the loss of our dear sisters, but at least now, we can get on with our lives. I may have misjudged you, Outlander. You are a true hero, and testament to the noble spirit which has inspired our order for generations. Farewell, my friend. Farewell indeed. So let's speak to all these fellows. That portal's still there. I guess you can have mass portals at any one time. Loads of portals. Yes. Ah, oh, he doesn't have anything nice to say to me then. Let's sell that. Did I identify all of these? Yes, I did. That's worth a fair bit. Why is it worth a fair bit? Because it's got quite a lot of stuff to go with it. That's worth a lot. Heck, I could even wear that, couldn't I? I mean, that's better than nothing, isn't it? Because I still, after killing all the bosses and that I have, I still haven't improved on this level 3 weapon. Typical, eh? Bloody typical. I 
You might be screaming at me right now saying that you can actually get better weapons or use some of that stuff I've been selling, but I don't know. I don't know. But I can definitely use this. That's going to help a bit, isn't it? Stop me from getting so screwed. And more of these crappy rings that no one cares about. See, that all do quite nicely. 8% better chance of getting magic items. Oh, well, I needed that a long time ago, didn't I? <laughs> Maybe now I'm wearing that, I'll finally get myself a decent staff. Until then. Good to see you. I can imbue. Magic socketed rare, unique or set items. I don't get it. Let's pick up one of these then. See if that can be imbued. It won't really let me imbue anything. Is it a warrior only thing? Oh well. What can I do, eh? Town portal. What about Wurt's leg? Can that be imbued? Yeah, that one actually can. Hmm. The caravan is prepared. We may now journey eastward to loot Golain. Oh, I see. So it's all come down to you now. Finally, we may rejoice. We owe you a debt we can never repay. I only hope that in time, we will be able to rebuild our order. All our thanks go with you, my friend. Good day. No problem. Let's get some basic potions. Some of the stamina potions as well, because I like those. And that'll do. Okay, um... Yeah to the next stage I guess do I need to talk to this guy again sound ready there you go um, yeah I guess that's it let's just imbue that fuck it so uh, all the things are done now in act one and I'll just feel happy about that job done there we go well, she's giving it quite a lot of stuff. I'm actually going to wear that, to be honest, because it can't be worse than that, can it really? So, let's do it. Let's do it. We'll keep this for keepsake, because it's got such beautiful memories. traveled east, over the mountains and into the vast deserts of broken lands. As the days passed, my companion told me of himself, that he had once been a great warrior, and that a dark and secret burden now weighed heavily upon him. We traveled for an eternity across that barren wasteland. How long? Oh, I couldn't say. And always, 
A dark cloud seemed to follow us just over the horizon. Finally, the journey ended. We climbed the last bridge. And there below us lay our destination. The shining jewel looped lane with a great sea beyond. We made camp there last night. Perhaps it was the warm desert wind or the sound of the ocean, but for the first time in many weeks, I slept. However, the dreams returned, but these were clearly not my own. I beheld the vision of a great man, the mage Talrasha. You were there too, Tyrael. I remember seeing you in my dream. His brethren had cornered a great demon, Baal, the Lord of Destruction, who had been set loose upon the world. They attempted to imprison the demon within a sacred stone. Yet when their attempts failed, Tarasha selflessly volunteered to contain the demon within himself, completing the prison. He instructed his brethren to bind him within a tomb, buried under the sand, there to wrestle with the demon for all eternity. Now you know what I seek, Marius. This is my brother. Sleep now. We set out with the dawn. The next morning, we walked over the hill toward Lutgulain. I had no idea then of the horrors that were in store for me there. Greetings. Hello. It has just cut off wraps because there was a lovely cutscene, but I would have probably put that in the video by now, which you probably would have already seen, but yeah. So this is the next area, so I am going to save and exit and take a break. Make sure... Uh... Yep. Yeah. Oh, hi. I have returned. Tis I, Witchy, back once again on another day, ready to take on Diablo 2, and I am going to blast through. Yeah, I'm going to cover a lot, but I'm also going to speed through those quests. No messing around with all those mobs that are sitting about, saying, kill me, kill me, you kill them, and then they're all there again. None of that messing around. Straight to business. This is serious business. So let's see what old Jaren has got to say for himself. Greetings, honored traveler. I am Jaren, Lord of Lut Golain, and I bid you welcome to my fair port city. I am glad to know that once again, caravans are free to travel through the Western Pass. For some time now, we have been under siege by an evil power that I cannot identify. Strange, it all began when a dark wanderer came this way, looking for the tomb of Talrasha. No one knows exactly where Talrasha, Keeper of Baal, is entombed, but it is certain to be far out in the desert. Now my people whisper tales of the dead rising from their tombs, and horrible creatures lurking amongst the moonlit dunes. Even I have witnessed things which I cannot explain. I've ordered the port closed and all trade ships moored until I am sure that my city